Hey everyone, back to an, to another video, and in today's video, well, we're going to be talking about the Ottoman Empire and their all the last couple months of them during the um, Turkish War of Independence, I believe it was called. Though I'm not be focusing on the war itself, more and morely the the Ottomans and their their war of resistance and the whole thing. <clears throat> the, Ottoman, the Ottoman Empire, a span, spanning spanning from Vienna to modern-day South Sudan at its height, and to Tunisia, but by the 1900s they had lost all power and suffering a devastating defeat in the Balkan Wars. L losing the last holdings of Europe, e except for East Thrace, where Constantinople exists, the capital of the empire, and they lost the last of their holdings in Africa. The last of their holdings in Africa fell. Also... And then, then the Sinai, they lost Sinai, which is the, which the Suez. After World War One, they lost Iraq, the Levant, which is where, which is where Syria and a bunch of other um, questionable states, I guess, exist. Uh, and bits in Arabia and bits of modern day Turkey. And which parts they lost were Kurdistan and uh, Constantinople was was a DMZ. The South was occupied by Italy and Greece and England. Uh, the Turkish War of Independence began with Armenians being pushed back by the Turks, led led by Mustafa Mustafa Kemal. I don't know if I said that right, but in in Ankara. In Ankara and the Ottomans in Constantinople in a, in, a, in a demilitarized zone or DMZ. And how they formed formed the Caliphate, the Caliphate army, a militia to stop to stop Kemal, and claiming that they're, 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 they they claim they claim that Kemal was the enemy of God. Which, you know, the whole jihad thing. Uh, Ahmad. Um, Ahmed Pasha. I don't think I said that right, but whatever. Organized an uh, uh, uprising. Where is the uprising? And one battle in the uprising was the Battle of Giev. We don't know how many died, but we do know that the Ottomans retreated. And the army was dissolved for the most part. S some, some, some were fighting the Greek summer offensive. Uh, wait, uh, for the most part, some fighting the Greek summer offensive. So, so some of them were fighting there, but I. I could not find any record of what they did, like which part of the battle or the offensives. But I didn't find that there were there were some two thousand soldiers who did fight, which well, it was it dwarfed the other the other forces they that uh, even Greece had in England, and they were led by. Oh dear God! Uh, Suleiman Sevik Pasha. And but by the, uh, but by this point, all influence was gone by the Ottomans, so they really stood no chance. The Ottomans' leader was a thing of the past. As soon as England and Greece left them, it was over. But not much was accomplished by this war of resistance. Maybe it. Maybe it hurt the British in the Irish War of Independence and helped the the Kurdish, or the Kurds, or the the Kurds hold out until today in Iraq and bits of Turkey and Persia, or Iran if you want to call it that, and preserving history and here's another thing I add in I don't know why I add in but the last Ottoman ruler, um he he fled to France, and the Germans invaded he was he was there and. And uh, and a couple days before they liberated it, he died. Like the next day, he was gonna be liberated. But uh, yeah, and I found something of him trying to form a, to try and form a government exile to try and retake Turkey. Which I, I it would have been a dumb idea, full full hardy or I don't know, whatever. And so. I want to use Battlefield 1 footage for this, but the problem is that I don't feel like downloading Battlefield 1, especially nowadays that it's, I love Battlefield 1, but it's dead. 
night. There's only like one mission, but you you have, you can have to play as um as the rebels in uh the uh Arabian rebels with uh, Lawrence of Arabia. It's a single player because the multiplayer is pretty much dead. And so I chose this footage because I'm at this gun right here the. Eighteen ninety eight, I think, or eighteen eighty nine. One two is a German rifle, and the Ottoman Empire used it during during the war and during World War One. And so, yeah. Uh, something else. What was I gonna add? Um. Oh, well, I guess I. I guess I'll put it in the description if I remember. Or I'm just an idiot. I'm thinking I forgot something when I really didn't. Well, anyways, um, if you want to see my script, it'll be in the description. Or, or you want to have some links to some more stuff to read about where I got all this from, you can. And the thing is, there isn't too much in this. I did find Kanya. There was one. I think it was the most in-depth uprising, but... It's, I couldn't really find too many. I don't know. It didn't really accomplish too much and it wasn't as interesting. But they but they realized that if they failed if their uprising failed, the Ottoman Empire would have they they believed that um that a Turk or Um I forgot his name, god damn it. Um that he wanted to disband the Ottoman Empire. Which, yeah, was kind of true and kind of not, I guess, depending on how you look at it today. With the whole Turkey and Greece wanting to kill each other still. So, oh, and the footage ended. Ah, oh, well, crap. Well, I guess I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Uh, keep on loving history. I should really get a better intro.